Hey guys, what is up? So, I decided to try something different today, and here's a study with me video. So, I hope you guys like it. Alright, there I am studying. Yeah, look at me go. Look at me go. Okay. Yeah, not really. Anyway, yeah, the reason I need to do all that studying is because I, my dumb self, got like kind of a little stressed out and overwhelmed with this whole virtual schooling thing, kind of like shut down. But like, yeah, I don't know. I kind of, I just, I don't like it. I don't like being online. Like, I know I keep saying it and ranting about it, but I loathe it. I despise it so much. And I, like, I don't know what to do. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, I probably should try my best all the time and stuff, but it's really hard when you're doing something you really don't want to do. But then again, I guess to be successful and stuff, I've got to do a whole bunch of stuff I don't want to do in life. And yeah, I get that, but, like... Yeah, I don't know. And I don't want this, like, me being online, going to online school to make me, like, weird and creepy one day. Because, like, I'm not around people. Like, I don't want to turn out weird and creepy. I don't know. But, yeah. And I hate that I'm not around people every day. And it's also, like, the part that I don't go anywhere because I, like, I hate being at home. I'm not going to lie. I love going places and doing stuff and stuff. And me, like, not going places and doing stuff is just hurtful and really hard on me so yeah but I guess I gotta do better you know because life is full of those like things doing things you don't want to do all the time and stuff and I'm not gonna lie it's not like all horrible I do do stuff I go to dance which again I really like dance and stuff but like I don't know sometimes I feel like that I'm not going anywhere with my dancing I mean I guess where do I want to go I just want to get better and i'm not sure i am i mean yeah i guess i have confidence i mean i started at tiktok but yeah you guys can go follow me or don't because some of the videos are kind of cringe so maybe don't go follow me but um yeah i honestly don't know what to do about this whole online school situation but i guess i'll just do my best because like I don't really have another option. My mom really doesn't want me to go anywhere else. And with COVID and everything. I think I feel like COVID ruined everybody's lives. Like, legit. No kidding. I just hope it's over soon. I really, really, really hope it's over soon. Yeah. Didn't need a job. I said I was going to get a job my last video. Which I am. I'm working on it. Um. Yeah, I need a job. Because I'm broke. Guys, I am dead broke. <laughs> like, not even funny. But anyway, yeah. What else? What else? What else? What else? I don't even know. Maybe I'm not supposed to be talking during any study with me videos. I think people just, like, study. But I'm going to talk because I love to talk. Yeah. If some of you guys like these, if you guys like these, maybe I have to make more of these videos because, like, I can make footage of me studying for hours and hours and hours, and maybe that'll actually help me to want to study. I don't know. And, like, I love my YouTube channel. That's honestly the only thing that, like, keeps me going sometimes is this channel because, like, it makes me happy. This is dancing. And I love school. And or at least I used to and that used to keep me going too but I feel like me not going to a school that I want to go to and me going to just any school um well me going to this online school in particular I guess it kind of like stopped my joy I know that sounds crazy but yeah I don't know but then again I just I guess learning in general I'm supposed to I I, I want myself to love it because that's the person that I want to be in a way and I guess that's weird but it's true so yeah I'm just gonna like try to love it or learn to love it yeah learn to love learning yeah yeah I know that sounds kind of weird but yeah that's what I am going and want to do so yeah what else also like I don't know, 2022, I made that video. Well, I made that video at the end of 20, end of January. But 2022, it's like, it started off kind of, um, kind of weird, you know? Just like on a 
different no you know i don't know i guess i guess i still got the whole year you know i still had 11 months to do everything that i want to do and i'm gonna do it because like i want to do it but at times yes you heard me in my bed but i don't know i just feel like i don't know I guess I didn't accomplish in January what I thought I was going to accomplish, you know, if it makes any sense, but I feel like I'm going to do better this month in February, and I'm going to, like, I got to do something different, because I feel like I do the same thing over and over and over again, like, it never works, I always try to do my work, start off great, and then I fail, or I mess up, or I stop doing great. And, like, I don't know how to not do that. I've been doing it for so long. It's, like, it's my pattern. And I don't want that. I don't want to have a pattern, especially one as messed up as that one is. Like, it's not me. And the person, I guess that is me now, but it's not the person that I want to be. So I'm going to do something about it, which starts with me, I guess, studying right here because, like, it's something different. And it gets me to actually study. So, maybe I'll make more of these videos. I honestly don't know. I don't know. I don't know anything right now. Well, I know some stuff. But, yeah. I just, I hope next year, okay, I feel like, I feel like I'm rambling and I'm going from subject to subject. But, yeah, I guess I'm still on the topic of changing. But, I hope that like next school year I go to a different school and I wonder like if going to a different school gonna stop my problems stop me from doing the same cycle that I do over and over again or is it just gonna be the same same Jessica and a different school like I don't know nice everybody's going through like everything and I get that you know like this year, these past couple of years have been pretty intense and pretty crazy. And it's just like, this is what the world is right now. It's coronavirus, it's COVID, it's everything that's really, really messed up. And like, I don't know. I guess it's sad and depressing sometimes. If you think about the last couple of years, it just makes me want to cry. I'm like, everything is... I know this is going to be sound redundant, but it is it's so bad. And I don't know what to do. I'm just a kid. Well, okay, I'm not a kid. I was a grown in a year, but I don't know. It's so messed up. Also, that's crazy to say I'm going to be 18 this year. Yes, I'm 17, which is crazy. I know. People don't think I look 17. Like, nobody thinks I look 17. But, yeah. I don't know. And I guess that's part of my issue, too, right now, is that I'm about to be grown this year. I'm about to be legally an adult at 18, and I'm a sophomore. Like, I'm sorry, but that's pathetic. It really is, in my opinion, to me, for me, it is. Like, it's not, that's not who I wanted to be. It's not how Jessica envisioned her life. It's not how I envisioned my life going. But I guess, I don't even know. I guess that's what got out in store for me. Which I'm scared. I'm going to be honest. Like, my life is not the life I thought I'd have or I'd plan to have. And I'm really scared that I'm not going to have the life I plan to have, like, as an adult. Because starting off now, I feel like scared and unprepared to be 18 in November, which is weird. So, yeah. And also, like, I feel like I'm so immature for my age. I mean, I know that sounds weird to say, but, like, I do. Like, I feel like I'm moving at a slow pace just with everything in life. And, like, me, like, growing up is moving at, like, a snail's pace. 
I mean, like, I have my tips, but I still have a step behind the drivers. I have not step behind the wheel, and I'm and I've had my tips since November. This is not that long, but it's quite a long time. I mean, that's because my mom is, I don't have anybody to teach me to drive, which, like, really sucks, you know, because I want to learn to drive so bad. Because I feel like once I learn to drive my YouTube channel, I can, my YouTube channel can, like, be anything. I can go anywhere and do anything and go on so many adventures. And I just, I really, really want to go on adventures. I love adventures. Yay, adventures. Anyway, no, but adventures. Yeah, I feel like I'm moving at a snail's pace, and driving is just, like, one example. I probably think of a couple more, but I don't know. Then I feel like I'm weird. I mean, I'd always felt like I was weird. Maybe I am. Okay, yeah, I'm weird. Um, and I guess, I mean, I said that last video, but I am, and I love myself for it, but at the same time, I hate myself for it sometimes, too. Meaning that, like, I could, like, be city somewhere or doing something and make it so awkward or say something so stupid and I embarrass the crap out of myself. And I don't know. And then I just feel so guilty and bad for myself because, like, I don't like embarrassing myself, making a fool out of myself. So, yeah. And then I felt like, and then, okay, I don't know why. I don't know. Um, that's so crazy but yeah and then like I just I don't know I just I want to succeed in life you know and the sales pace thing like I don't want to be here forever be a person that's never happy knowing where they're at and I'm like so afraid of that I'm so afraid of failing at life and staying in Ohio forever, which I don't want to do. I'm not going to lie. I hate it in Ohio. Like, I don't like it here at all. I'm not even going to, like, lie. Like, I do not like it here. There, I feel like there's nothing here for me. I never go anywhere or do anything, which I guess is my mom's fault because, like, he never takes me out or did or anything. But at the same time, like, what is there to do here? Like, I want to go somewhere like Miami or Cali. I still want to live in California. But anyway, or, L or um, where, where else? Oh, or New York, you know? So we're to hope, like, with my dreams and stuff. Maybe my dreams are basic. I want to be um, an actress. And, um, but yeah, they're my dreams. And that's the only thing I want to be. I also want to be a dancer, a, uh, um, a dancer, singer, no, I do not want to be a singer, I cannot sing, but anyway, a dancer, I want to, um, get a degree here, programming, I want to be a chef, I love to cook, um, and I want to be a couple, I want to make a couple other, other degrees, so, I feel like that's the one I want to be, it's just one of the things, and that is another one of my problems, me wanting to do and be so much, it's like, I feel like I want so much out of life that it's like, it over, it's overwhelming. Like, I overwhelm myself. Thinking about everything I have to do and accomplish in my lifetime. And I guess I'm just scared. Scared that I'm going to fail and not going to accomplish anything wanting to do so much. And then some people are just like, pick one thing and just do that. But like, how do you pick one thing out of your dreams? Like, I don't want to do that. I want it all. You know, I want to have it all, do it all, and be it all. And, like, I don't know. Can Jessica really have it all? I don't know. Is Jessica, I guess, can Jessica, or can't Jessica have it all? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, that was baby. I sound like a baby. Which is another thing where I, people think I feel like a baby. Well, people think I'm like a kid. Because I talk like a kid. I don't know why. Sometimes I do. Like, really? Okay, that's enough about me doing voices. Okay, see an example of how I'm weird and I embarrass myself. But, anyway. Yeah, I don't know. This world is so 
like different and I don't know like it's not the world that I thought I did when I was nine ten years old well I guess I um I guess I mean duh it's not I didn't think it'd be anything but I try to like plan out my entire life and like I thought I'd be somewhere else you know instead of here but I guess I can't really plan my whole life out and expect it to actually go as planned but I'm a planner I love planning my day and stuff and it going as planned which spoiler alert most of the time it doesn't because I don't have the discipline well I do have some discipline but that's actually what I'm working on for 17 I said my 17 I was gonna work on discipline and hard work but anyway I feel like I don't have the discipline to like do it and go forth with it because like I guess when things go wrong sometimes I make excuses sometimes I justify and like justify why I don't get stuff done when like you know, that was just really bad and I don't want to do that I don't want to be a person that makes excuses which is why I came up with this saying for my life no excuses and no exceptions it's like and I guess in a way that means that I have to always do what I say I'm going to do I have to be the person that I want to be no matter what happens. Because at the end of the day, life's always going to happen. So you can choose to either do something about it and keep do something about it and keep working and keep going or sit on your butt and make excuses for yourself. And I don't want to be the person that makes excuses for myself and justifies my laziness and the things that I should be doing. So, yeah. Alright guys, also like, don't mind my hair, it looks kind of bad. Anyway, see you guys next week in my next video. Videos go up every Friday, and yeah, live your best life, you're amazing, and peace, even though you can't see me do the peace sign. Uh, yeah, bye!